In this screencast, we're going to talk about web color basics and some helpful tools you can use during your site development. I have a blank HTML page here. So if you've seen some of the CSS screencasts on OGSolution.com, you may already know my usual ways of setting up web colors. Let's say if we have this is some text and we want to make the text red. We can do body color. We can just do red like that. And this text would become red. But you can also use the hex code, which is pound FF0000. If you don't know what the color is, you can always use color picker here. Look for the colors. These are the color names and these are the corresponding hex code. Let's go to R red right here, which is FF0000. Then automatically transfer it to red for you. But let's do FF0000 save it, minimize it. Let's open it up in our browser. Now the text is red. Let's minimize it, bring it back. I want to show you another thing. Sometimes I would do this. So the hex code is composed of six digits. These two, the FF is a pair, the second zero zero is another pair, and the last zero zero is another pair. So if you see that this pair is the same, and these two numbers are the same, these two numbers are the same, you can write a shorthand way of the color representation by doing this. This is the same as FF0000. This is called the triplets. Now let's minimize this refresh, it's the same color. Simple enough. Now, let's look at Firefox add-ons called Colorzilla. This will help you pick out colors within your web page. Now, all you have to do is go to Tools, Add-ons. I already have this installed, but I'm going to walk you through it. When you get to the Mozilla add-ons page, Type in Colorzilla, search for it. It'll be this one. Click on it. Scroll down and you can install right here. Once you install Firefox, we'll restart its browser and then you can start using it. And you'll see it right here at the bottom left corner. This tool icon, eyedrop icon. If you left click on it and mouse over all the areas within the web page, it'll tell you at the status bar, the bottom status bar, all the color information, RGB color, hex color code, and body elements. And let's say you want that red, to mouse over the red, click on it, it's going to store this red color information. If you want to copy this, you can't copy from here. You have to right click uh, right here. And then you can do copy the hex code, like that. Then you can find somewhere else. Let's say we want it here. Let's do paste. And it's right here. Nice little tool to help you look for awesome colors online. Now, when you are creating a site design from scratch. You'll most definitely need to choose the color scheme for your site. I have a site that I always go to when it comes to choosing colors. I want to share that with you. It's called www.color it's u r colorlovers.com this site has all sorts of color schemes, 
color trends, patterns, and people can actually vote for it, vote their favorite ones. So whenever I have uh, some color issues or mental blocks, I can come here and look for some ideas. And that's it for this screencast. Thank you.